Hello Collective, welcome back to the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. Um, so I've been picking up on, I think this is like a Queen of Cups reverse and a group of friends that are planning on stealing some type of money out of an account. Um, it's like they're waiting for some money to be deposited into an account so that they can uh, withdraw it. She's planning on misrepresenting herself and showing up at a bank and pretending to be someone that she's not so that she can get money out of a specific account that does not belong to her. There's some type of, um, there's, I don't know what this is. But there's a group that has something set up behind the scenes where it's like they have a lot of different companies involved in some type of scheme. So like the bank is aware someone may have like some type of insider in the bank where like when they go to make this uh, withdrawal, steal this money, whoever is in that bank knows what's going on and they're supposed to be there to help them make the transaction easy and nothing looks out of the norm. Uh, this is going to backfire horribly. Uh, I don't know why these people are so set on making sure that someone stays living in some type of like poverty or something like that. There's either an institution or someone of high honor trying to balance something out behind the scenes, but there's a group of people with a plan of their own, okay? Um, this Yeah, an institution is trying to balance something out, but there's a group of friends that are still out here trying to defeat someone. There's a Queen of Cups reverse, especially, that's planning on misrepresenting herself, so she's going to take some type of action to go to an institution to have some money withdrawn out of an account or this could be a queen of pentacles in reverse as well it's a quite it's a few women involved in something that are planning on taking some type of money that does not belong to them and it is going to backfire horribly yeah something is going to backfire horribly it may even be causing them a lot of burdens right now trying to take some type of reckless and impulsive action someone may be may be uh being stopped in their track or something uh, they may have tried to cause you some type of defeat as well as far as like trying to prevent you from receiving some type of payout. Um, it's like they're trying to block, they're trying to cause some type of blockage between someone and their finance. This could be like a King of Cups they're doing it to or a Queen of Cups Empress Energy. But they're trying to cause some type of blockage between you and your finances. So if you have money that you are expecting to come in, there's someone trying to take some type of reckless or impulsive action to block you from receiving that financial payout so that you can stay living in some type of like where you're having to yeah there's a plot to steal but something is going to be balanced out okay where you can stay living in some type of financial like having to manage having a budget and things like that but this chapter you want to end it in this chapter successfully um yeah they're taking some type of reckless action. They may have had some type of short uh, live victory in the past. So maybe they were able to get into a system and block something, right? I don't know, like block some type of deposit or cause some type of hindrance, right? Um, but something is being balanced out. They are still trying to take some type of action. Someone is very uh, hostile behind the scenes. Someone's very angry behind the scenes. And so they're taking some type of action or maybe this is something they did in the past but with it going this way, this is something they have already done or they are actively doing uh, to put some type of hot. They're planning to bring something to an end, right? They may have taking some type of action or they're trying to do something either to block you from receiving some money, take you out, but just to cause you some type of havoc in your life so that you can be left out in the cold if you are trying to. There's something where it's like people don't want you paying your bills. People don't want you balancing your life out. So if you are trying to pay your bills on time, there's something where it's like these people have connections within these institutions or they've created some type of a false call center where when you call, they are intercepting calls and they are the ones answering the calls and things like that and making, it th making you think that you're actually talking to the 
institutions that you are reaching out to, but it's not really those institutions. It's these people you're talking to on the phone. Uh, something is going to be exposed. This could be a whole community, a family that's doing something like this behind the scenes. It is going to be exposed. There could be a family or an institution that ends up having to pay quite a lot of money. They're going to go through some type of loss, some really horrible loss. A queen of pentacles may be going through some type of loss. I don't know if like a queen, king of cups walked away. Um, yeah, they're trying to put an end to your wish fulfillment, you being content and fulfilled in life, being stable, financially independent and things like that. They're trying to put an end to it. I think there's a king of cups that may have left either like a queen of pentacles reverse. This was like a tumultuous relationship this man had been in for a long time. I picked up on this in a few of my readings. I kept seeing a king of cups leaving a situation, like a toxic situation. Um, this man has freed himself from some type of toxic karmic situation and they are trying to draw him back into their relationship to have him trapped and bounded. They don't want him being fulfilled. They don't want him healed. Uh, they could, what I'm hearing also, there could be a king of cups that may have missed understood a situation. I don't know if he tried to like uh, talk to someone he's interested in, um, but this could be someone that's very shy or something like that and doesn't necessarily know how to approach whoever he's interested in. So maybe he misunderstood a situation. Maybe he tried to talk to you and you didn't know what was going on and you probably didn't pay this person any mind. I don't know what the situation is, but whatever it is, this King of Cups is le has left, uh, yeah, he has left a situation no longer collaborating with a group of farmers people left an unhappy either marriage or relationship someone has been settling for a long time something is being looked into you may have someone that wants to uh have closure with you someone may be wanting to communicate with you as well and they have foresight uh whatever these people are planning as far as blocking you from having wish fulfillment so whether this is your business growing or you receiving your financial payout your abundance whatever it is someone behind the scenes has foresight of this situation they what they're trying to do is to block you from having this fulfillment and to keep you waiting. Like they want you stuck in a waiting period, stuck in your mind. Like when is this money coming in? When is this payout coming in? When am I going to get the house? When am I going to get this promotion? When am I going to get this job? Don't do any of that. Everything is going to be balanced out when it's supposed to. These are just people. I don't know what is wrong with these people by this end. Okay, at this end. Um, but someone in this situation may have foresight of what a queen of swords has been doing. Also, you could be a queen of swords. Someone may be seeing you as someone that's very genuine. A loyal friend, a, 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 a genuine friendship is given to people from you. I don't know how to put that. I was really so Shakespeare beer the way i just said that <laughs> um but people may be seeing you or someone in this scenario is seeing you as a genuine queen of swords like you say exactly what it is you have to say there's no ill intent behind it people that are not uh self-aware or comfortable within themselves or not confident they can oftentimes mistaken the queen of swords from for being someone that's very malicious spiteful and hateful if she resides in the negative energy of the queen of swords then yeah but typically someone that represents the queen of swords in the upright they're just direct with their words and say what it is they have to say and they leave it at that there's no ill intent behind it oftentimes when they're even speaking to you there's no emotions to it it's just them telling you what it is they're thinking what it is they have to tell you and they leave it at that there's no ill intent behind it there's no malicious maliciousness uh, behind it but someone is seeing you as a good friend a loyal friend so they may be taking some type of action to come towards you they want to meet with you uh, may want to invest or work with you or something like that thrill of caution as well because this could be someone that's privy to what has been going on behind the scenes i'm telling you They've been privy to what has been going on behind the scenes and it has maybe been sitting back and watching something play out and not doing anything about it. Or this could be someone else, the corporate of what is going on and maybe they're seeing things from a different perspective now and they want to come in and balance something out. So someone may have had like a short-lived victory in the past or this group may have had a short-lived victory in the past as far as being able to trap you or block you from something or trap this masculine or whoever this is. But this is over. Um, they were not able to trap you for a long time or for however long they thought they were going to be able to with the knight of swords out here in the reverse that means that whoever took this hostile action this uh aggressive action they're stuck in something now that they cannot get out of and someone may be angry behind the scenes this could be a queen of wands that took some type of impulsive actions 
action trying to block you from receiving some type of financial payout or financial abundance. Like there's a woman that's very angry when she sees the amount of, I don't know, money you're supposed to be receiving or what someone wants to give to you because they know this is going to help you move on with your life. You may be connecting with a king of wands that wants to give to you. Seizure is very dedicated, hardworking, and knows that you're moving forward towards victory. We'll have a lot of offers and opportunities when it comes to like your work, your career, streams of income and things like that. And they know you are someone that has mastered yourself. Um, there's a lot of manipulations that have been going on. There's a Queen of Cups out here. There's Queen of Cups. Queen of Cups reverse that I'm picking up on has been watching you secretly and keeping it uh, mute, pretending like she doesn't know um, what it is you do. Someone has been pretending like they're not aware of you, but this is someone that's been watching you and knows exactly what it is you do and may have even been copying your uh, style, your way of doing things. So you basically have like a groupie out here pretending to be you while you're not around. Uh, someone may be unhappy about some type of communications you're going to be receiving. Uh, just be very cautious. There is something where I keep picking up on someone going into like email accounts and deleting emails and things like that so that you don't receive the communications that you're supposed to receive. Um, because it's an emperor that wants to give you some type of new opportunity or have some type of some type of fresh start with you in life. And there's a group of friends that are burning behind the scenes about this. They don't want you having this genuine love. They don't want this emperor having this connection with you. These people are intimidated by you, which is why they are going to this length to um to uh, um to stop the two of you from connecting there's a lot of fighting going on behind the scenes a lot of arguing a lot of just tumultuousness all kinds of i don't even know if tumultuousness is a word it is today we're going to make it a word um but it's a lot of competition a lot of uh conflict arguing just a lot of unhealthy toxic behavior going on behind the scenes about you receiving some type of growth going through some type of birth sprout accelerations and things like that they're trying to put an end to that they're trying to put an end to you receiving communication someone is planning reach planning on reaching out to you and they will in due time but what it is is that these these people are trying to block this. They're fighting about you receiving this message. This, I don't know, assistance, this growth. You've been left alone to be you. Um, basically, it's what I'm picking up on. These people are trapped in some type of karmic cycle. Like, they put themselves in voluntarily. If you can, like, all of these people are impulsive. They're reckless. Uh, very combative. Uh, these are people that are disloyal as heck. Uh, they uh, misrepresent themselves. So, I mean... When I say that, I mean, as far as these are people that pretend like they're advocating for you, but in the background, they're really doing things to take you down, destroy you, and all of that. Uh, someone's, I don't know, I keep picking up on an emperor. So this could be someone's boss, someone's father, someone's husband, grandfather, that is part of this situation. And he's just waiting for the right moment to be able to... Uh, I don't know, get some type of financial pay. Also, if you're receiving some type of money, he's waiting for the right time to withdraw that. Or there's something malicious like a, a emperor reverse is plotting on doing and it's going to backfire. Someone is about to lose everything because they made some type of wrong business moves and partner up with the wrong people. And it has come back to backfire on him or her terribly and someone is i don't know if they're trapped or bonded to a situation with this devil out here maybe they don't see a way out of it but i don't know what it is you may have defeated the devil and this is something that's pissing these people off um i woke up this morning i i stayed by myself with my children we don't have anyone else living with us what i heard uh was a man's voice saying that uh, you are the youngest person they've ever done this to or something like that. So there could be like a group of older people that have been coming after a younger energy. Uh, I'm all the clears. So sometimes I hear stuff, see stuff, feel stuff, smell stuff, whatever. Um, so the, you may have like a group of older, I don't know, men and women coming after you trying to just block your forward movement. There's some type of, I don't know if it's a test or this is how they see it. They went through this scenario as well at a certain age, but they all failed this test. Okay. Somehow you are maybe younger than these people. I'm not sure what the what the situation is, whether it, it's your age, your youth, your mindset, your energy, whatever it is. You've come and outdone these people. Something has gone a lot long farther than they thought you would last. So you've outlasted your enemies. Now for you to receive your 
the fruits of your labor because basically you've had to kind of fight to get to where you are. Some of you have had to fight to even stay alive. These people don't want you receiving your fruits, okay? They want you to stay in like, and this is how dark workers always operate. Nothing is ever fair with them. They don't care about being fair. It's that we put you in this situation to test you, to prove that you're not who you say you are. Turns out you are who you say you are, but we still don't want you to have wish fulfillment in life. But you are going to have your victory, okay? You are going to have your victory. These people are about to be going through some type of karma. They're plotting. Why they're going through karma, they are still plotting okay yeah right here someone has foresight of what either an, an institution has been doing a higher fin has been doing uh, people may know that a higher fin knows the truth about people trying to steal something from you keep a hold something that does not belong to them so there's some type of justice that's going to be playing out you and someone will be meeting someone has very fond memories of you they could be in this community um, but maybe they're now expressive they are now being expressive when it comes to how they feel about you. Like, I like this person. And it, it doesn't have to be romantical. It can just be, uh, you know, I think this person is genuine. I see them as a friend. I see them as someone I want to have a friendship with. Um, and they may be pissed off at a group of people for doing something to block your victory, block your success or something like that. So there could be a higher fence that's leaving an institution behind to uh, kind of just move forward and try to live in their truth. They may want to communicate with you, have some type of get together as far as being on the same page, maybe some type of um, uh, uh, apologies if needed to take place um but there is something going on um behind the scenes that maybe you're not privy to you may be and this is why you're standing your ground and you keep investing in what it is that matters to you and it has these people living in fear because every day that you show up wherever you are you're nine to five regardless of the field you work in whether it's your business social media it has these people living in fear because every day you show up there's more more and more truth coming out and it has them pissed off that you are still moving forward in victory and there's an emperor out here that wants to be with you look at this you two are a matched emperor empresses and this is a divine union this is judgment this is the both of you's justice so you two could be gifts to each other and this is how the universe has deemed it so. Uh, you two are going to be taking new directions, new paths in life. And this is balance and restoration in you two's life. Yeah, listen, this is going to be a union, whether it be business, platonic, or romantic. Um, this is going to be very successful. Someone is going to go for it in due time to connect with you, put an end to all their karmic ways. Uh, maybe someone has been going through some type of healing and learning how to balance himself, getting in touch with it, with his creative side. Yeah, with his creative side, he's getting in touch with this. This could be someone that's in the public eye, someone very high ranking. Uh, this could be someone that's very, uh, like up there in the social class when it comes to, our society i don't know how to put that but someone with this ten of pentacles out here this is someone very affluent maybe maybe well known uh you may not be aware of this person but they are aware of you and they may want to work with you maybe uh yeah move things forward with you they've been trying to maybe get into your energy but there's been a lot of hiccups along the way this person sees you as which fulfillment someone they may want to build some type of uh abundance with um and yeah build some type of abundance have ultimate fulfillment with commit to this so they may be reaching out to give you something to balance things out and have destiny play out like it's supposed to and it has a queen of wands Behind the scenes, that's very burdened, trying to figure out how she can cause some type of stagnation, cause you some type of tower. These are the kind of things people people like these do and make it seem like it's a natural disaster, but it's not. There's something this woman keeps doing and it's backfiring on her. She's trying to find out how she can cause a tower to your intuition, block your intuition, right? And block your work block your commitment, block people being able to see you as skilled, people taking you seriously, but maybe people are looking into you. They say, oh gosh, damn, we like this person right here. This one right here, right here. Yeah, we are definitely going to be watching this one here. We choose to watch this one right here, right here. What you been talking about, Elizabeth? You said this person didn't know what they were doing. Seems like they're either just as skilled as you or even more skilled as you. Yeah, people have awareness 
People have awareness of the truth. They have clarity. Something has been illuminated that Elizabeth has been out here stealing from her temperance energy. May have even been stealing from her partner in business. Uh, stealing uh, opportunities, ideas, and things like that. And everything is being exposed. Uh, so everything is going to be balanced out in due time like it's supposed to be. You, Queen of Swords, in the upright, you will be receiving your Ten of Pentacles. Um, someone knows, yeah, things are going to be balanced out for you. These people or someone in this community knows eventually something's going to be balanced out. They just don't know when it is. And they are afraid of that day because they know once, once it is balanced out, <clears throat> excuse me, it's game over for them. So the universe is stepping in to balance something out for a Queen of Cups upright. You are that Queen of Cups, Queen of Swords, Queen of Wands, Queen of Pentacles in the upright Empress energy, right? Not the ones in the dark community. But the universe is out here. Like the, your angels are out here balancing something out for you, okay? You may not know it. Maybe, maybe you feel it. But you have some type of blessing coming into you. And this is all due to your strength. Uh, and you being very abundant, you being someone that gives very easily to other people, you look out for other people. Maybe people were trying to steal your abundance, but you're out here maybe shining the truth, speaking your truth, living in your truth, however way you're doing it. And this is bringing clarity to someone that's of high honor, that's very innovative, a thinker. And again, this could be someone in the public eye, someone very innovative, creative, uh, original, authentic, all kinds of goodness, Okay. Uh, so they're, they're just like you and they're taking actions to balance something out. This has been a long time coming, but this is destiny playing out. Um, so this is quite a beautiful. I'm loving this. This is a positive message. Absolutely. You are receiving what is yours. Okay. You are receiving what is yours. Um, if someone is trying to steal some money from you or steal, like get into your bank account to steal something from you, um, there is someone that has awareness that these people are very malicious. Even if someone has been pretending to be okay with something being given to you, there's someone around her, whoever this institution is or, or, is, or higher fin is, they know this person is just pretending to be okay with something. So they're going to be taking actions to do something a specific way, which I'm not going to say on here because these people are watching videos abusing divinations and things like that so they can stay ahead of the game so they've been out here doing a lot of malicious things to people and thinking that they're going to get away with it you're not getting away with it this is just something that's playing out like you're supposed to someone stands to lose everything you have already lost everything uh someone may even get so like Someone may end up being so broke, like they won't even be able to pay like their phone bills on time. Like they won't be able to do a lot of things on time. Someone's priority is making sure their phone bills, if phone bill is paid, so that they can stalk other people online. You gotta be BSing me. So, anyways, um, they're not able to block or stop you from receiving your abundance, your inheritance. They're, they're trying to stop your independence is what I'm picking up on as well. They don't want you being independent, self-sufficient, being comfortable in life. They don't like your humble nature. Your humble nature bothers someone as well. They don't want you taking care of yourself. They don't want people to see you as someone that is clean. Uh, these are all toxic friends that got together to come up after you and they have done nothing but trap themselves in some type of situation that is just really horrendous. The whole family is reckless. They're hostile. They're in impulsive, very greedy, uh, disloyal as can be, very combative, not brave, but more so like just reckless and impulsive when it comes to what it is that they're doing and how they go about doing business. Something is being dismantled. It's that people are trying to keep something going that they already know is done, is dead. Like something is dead and gone, but they're trying to hold on to it. Something, something unholy is being destroyed. So there's something holy I mean, not really holy, but something in the upright, right? Something that's built on a stronger, solid, and genuine foundation can be brought up, okay? So one kingdom is falling as another is rising up. And that's how the cycle of life is, the cycle of incarnation is, okay? That's part of our experience. Um, 
but yeah there's a queen of swords also in a community you all may want to be very cautious of this is someone that's been doing a lot of manipulation i don't know if maybe someone is turning a new leaf i doubt it with this woman's energy i've been picking up on for a long time this is someone that's just cold blooded she could be going through a tower while she's calculating a tower for you now you know the towers i always say it's supposed to be something that's the act of god right but these are people that believe in creating their own towers into other people's lives so she's gonna go through hers while she's trying to create one for you at the end she's gonna have to move on this is someone that may consider herself to be like a high priestess or something but she operates from the lower energy of the high priestess so this is not someone you really want to be associated with anyways thank you so much for watching stay blessed i'll see you in my next read goodbye for now